that's when I first set my eyes on Evelyn. And I reacted like any 13-year-old boy would. Oh, mercy. If it was 1964. Well, uh, hello. Is this Miss Norris' class? Sure is. Oh. School. A necessary evil. Uh, you know, you're like the spitting image of a younger Lindsay Lohan. Really? You think so? Without a doubt. I mean, you guys could be sisters. <laughs> I'm Harold. I'm Evelyn. I love her. Uh, personally, I think she's our generation's Elizabeth Taylor. A hey, new kid. You're in my seat. Oh, sorry. I did not know that. It was great meeting you, Lindsay. I mean, Evelyn. <laughs> I'll see you later, Harold. Okay, goodbye. Hey, Harold, huh? Thank you both. Hi, I'm Rhonda. Harold, new here. Nice to meet you, Harold. You're gonna love it here at Patterson. Okay, class, welcome back. It is wonderful to see all of your smiling faces again. Even yours, Brad Dennison. <laughs> <laughs> now, I'm sure you're all really happy that summer's over so you get to start studying again, right? Oh, and we have a new student with us this year, right? I'm Harold. Harold, why don't you come on up here and Tell everyone a little bit about yourself. Nothing that good. I just... Come on, Harold. Up we go. Well, uh, my name's Harold from Douglas. That's about all. Okay. Well, I don't know how they do things over in Douglas, but here at Patterson, we don't wear hats in the classroom. I'm sorry, but it's not going to interfere with my warning. You know, I'm just a very big... Astros fan. Oh, well, that's fine, but I, I don't allow baseball caps in the classroom, so please take it off. Did you know that at one point in time, the Astros were actually called the Cold 45s? Are you going to be a, a problem? No, no, I'm just trying to... Lose the hat. Okay. Did I mention I was bald? Okay, class, class, let's all behave like ladies and gentlemen. Uh, Harold, do you, um, you have some sort of disease going on? Nope, I'm just bald. Oh. <laughs> oh. I, okay. Well, you can go on back to your, your seat. <laughs> I think I'm really getting enjoyed here at Patterson. Oh, hey, Lindsay. I mean, Evelyn. Hi. Oh, How are hi, you? Harold. You like to walk? No. Oh, yeah, me neither. I've got bunions. Corn, spoils. I've got calluses full of pus on my feet. Oh. Oh, wow. Did you have a go kart, Harold? No. Oh. I love go-karts. Well, when I said I didn't have one, I meant it's not here. It's back here. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Where is it? Well, it's gonna be here soon. <laughs> Very soon. Yeah. Okay. Watch it. Hey, Evelyn. What are you doing with him? We're just talking. Oh. Leave her alone, you bald-headed freak. Well, all right. Listen, we're just having a conversation, and since it doesn't involve boogers or comic books, I doubt you'd be interested. Oh. You look like my left nut. <laughs> We're going to the racetrack. Hop in, Evelyn. I'll give you a ride. Sure. I'll see you later, Harold. See you later, Evelyn. Oh! My foot! <laughs> Bunions. Hey, Harold. You want to take a first spin? I don't think so. Come on. You know what? On second thought, maybe I will. Good. Well, hey, princess. Nice go-kart. Are you okay? Yeah, I think so. 
lucky you're wearing that helmet. Oh yeah, real lucky. Hey, look at it's Barbie and Baldy. Those guys think they're so cool. Well, they won't be laughing when I win the Patterson 500 go-kart race this year. Oh, hi, everyone. Hi. Hi, yeah, I'm having a thing for my birthday this weekend. You wanted to come, I think it would be cool. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> hey, Teach, I saw a bald eagle! <laughs> Ugh, where's a wild animal when you need one? Oh, my God! It's a bear! Oh, my God! It's a bear! <laughs> Yogi, now you've done it. Let's dance. <laughs> no, Gurgo, not twice in one day. That's it. That's it. You're my hero. Yeah, coming right now. Man, that field trip was crap. Not for me. I saw a hummingbird and a cardinal. <laughs> hey. Hey, Harold. Come here. All right, listen, guys. Got to go hang out with these high school kids. Being cool is a curse. Sometimes. Man, he's cool. Harold's so cool. Hey, buddy. Can you do us a favor? And then we can go riding around? Sure. You can help us out. I guess if you guys really want me to ride around with you, I can give you a few minutes. Get in. Shotgun! Tonight's the night. Everyone and I will be the only kids there. My dad's good. Now, what about that meatloaf for lunch the other day? <laughs> I don't think there's any meat in it. Ah, you're very witty. Thank you, Harold. Yeah. Hey, Harold. What's going on, man? Can't you see I'm talking to someone? Please go away. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, well, don't worry. I'll catch up with you later, sport. <laughs> sorry about that. Now, what about Mr. Jenkins and his computer class? He's a real <laughs> character. Oh, Harold, you always know just what to say. This is true. The boys are here. The word of my arrest got around school. And I wasn't prepared for the reaction. My sister told me you got arrested. You got arrested? What a dork. <laughs> oh, shut up, Brad. I think it's cool. What was it like in jail? Oh, you mean the big house? It wasn't that bad. We got along pretty well with the other cons. They called me Spider. <sighs> wow. They didn't, you know what? Big guys do to little guys? Uh-uh. Spider, don't play that. Cool. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Excuse me, Evelyn. Heard a little secret about you. What'd you hear? Somebody got a crush on you. Who is it? I'll give you a little clue. It's someone that looks a little more mature than the rest of these boys. If you try anything, I'm going to call the police. What? Hell no, it ain't me. We saw a video about guys like you in health class, and at the top of the list were band directors and janitors. Little ball kid, Harold. Remember I said look a little more mature than the rest of the boys? He's the one that likes you, not me. Fine, but you better stay away. Oh, shit. Good evening, ladies. I uh, brought you this corsage, Evelyn. Why? It's from your sweetheart. Kevin gave you that? Who's Kevin? The high school boy I'm dating. Wait a second, what about this note you wrote me? Right here? I didn't write you a note. Hey, sweetheart! <laughs> Congratulations. Thanks. Now, why don't you go and save that for your high school boyfriend, Toots? Now, if you don't mind, uh, we've got to go collect our trophy. Okay, shall we? Yep. Hey. 
Hi, my name is James. I'm one of Harold's friends. Um, you look sad. Yeah, I'm not that sad. Okay.